The fourth and final quarterfinal matchup pitted Group G winners Mountfield against Group B winners EV Zug. After a 2-2 tie last week in the Czech Republic, the squads readied for leg two with a trip to the semifinals on the line. Fast forward, final minute of the first period, Sven Santeler in on goal. He is pulled down by Christoph Lancet. penalty shot awarded to EV Zug. Santeler slowly weaving his way in on goal on Henry Kiviaho, but he will fire wide of the cage. Still 0-0 and 2-2 on aggregate. No goals in the first period. We go to the second, three minutes deep. Christian Juice takes it behind the cage. He's going to set up his D-man, Dominic Schlump. The one-timer, ping-pong puck in front. They jab at it. Eventually, it's pushed over the line. Justin Abdelkader, the former Detroit Red Wing, found a loose puck. His first ever CHL goal gives the Swiss a 3-2 advantage. Take a look at this from his rear end in a second ever CHL contest. Referees had a good long look at this sequence, eventually confirmed a good goal. Four minutes later though, Mountfield's turn. Alesh Yergel waiting in the slot, gets his stick on it, backhanded towards the net and somehow in the net. A wacky tally, it deflected first off the skate of Christian Juice, then gets caught underneath the skate of Leonardo Giannone. Kind of pulls it over the red line, Second goal of the tournament, and we are deadlocked three and three. We head to the third period. Another EV2 breakaway. This one for Gregory Hoffman, but wide of the cage, keeps the game tied. Henry Kiviaho would make 30 saves on this night in Switzerland. More chances for the home team. First Sven Sentler shut down. The rebound won't go either. Kiviaho denies Yannick Zainter. And he keeps Mountfield alive in the quarterfinal round. Fewer than five minutes to play, now it's Giannone's turn. A Coolier ahead of the pack, he is robbed by Leonardo. A 28 save night for the veteran goaltender. No goals in the final 430, we would need overtime. First opportunity off the faceoff win for Dario Simeone. Fires the backhander wide of the cage. Minutes later though, Brian O'Neill Gets the puck along the left wing. He spins. He deeks. He shoots. He scores. It's the overtime series winner from EV Tube's top scorer. And they take it on a 4 3 final on aggregate. EV Tube, the first Swiss team to reach the semifinal since 2016 17. They will face Tapera in mid January.